Midwest is well known for its agriculture. Farmers growing corn, soybeans, sunflowers, wheat, even Christmas trees. Right, lots of things around here. But when Jason Davis heard of a guy in Superior, Wisconsin, growing coral, well, that's news. When we go on the road, there's a place I want to see. Coral reefs are the ocean's jewels. Massive congregations of tiny animals that over thousands of years have grown one on top of the other to create one of the wonders of the world. Today, many people are keeping these strange creatures in home aquariums. And here, a thousand miles from the ocean, is where you can buy them. There are billions of dollars spent on live coral trade in the U.S. In the U.S. alone? Yeah, oh yeah. Morgan Gonia is a very unusual farmer. He grows coral here in this brand new plant in Superior, Wisconsin, and ships it all over the country. That's his love, corals and coral reefs. And uh, they are pretty. These farm fields are large, shallow tanks fed with a constant supply of warm, filtered salt water. The livestock are chunks of brightly colored coral purchased from wholesalers or grown right here. They're not really that much work. Once you get them in an aquarium, and get them established, they pretty much take care of themselves. Coral is a slow, isn't it? I mean, you can't make money by growing them. Oh, yeah, you can. Not only does coral reproduce readily in the tanks, it recovers quickly after being cut up for sale. I'll keep this to grow out until it's back to this size, and I'll cut it again. Morgan says most of the corals he grows will double their size in six months. If I just left this building, and came back in a year, corals would just be, you know, coming out of the water. Trading in coral is a highly regulated industry. Coral from overseas needs special import permits. Nobody's down there, you know, just cleaving coral from the reef and shipping it in FedEx to me up here in Minnesota. <laughs> Since he got his first goldfish bowl as a child, Morgan Gonia has been fascinated by corals. The entire life cycle of these passive ocean creatures is reproduced here under lights that replicate the tropical sunshine. And the corals just grow and grow and grow. Morgan Gonya and his dad, Alan, currently sell most of their corals on eBay, but they have high hopes for a website that they're currently setting up. Jason Davis, 5 Eyewitness News on the Road, Superior, Wisconsin.